So IK Garlic Shop, where we sell all kinds of kitchen accessories, home appliances, gas accessories, and electronics of all kinds. Today is another Friday with us when we get to teach you how to use some of the wonderful items you get from us so that when you get those items, you will know how to use them. Or if you already have them, you will know how to use them as well so that they will end up lasting for you. This is our way of saying thank you for your constant and continuous patronage. So today here, we'll be teaching you on how to use your electric oven. They have gas oven and they have electric oven. And we are talking here about this electric oven. And mind you, electric oven is different from a microwave. Electric oven, you use it to, for more of, let me say, you can use it to bake cake, you can use it to dry your meat, you can use it for roasting. But an oven, a microwave, is used to preheat your food. So it's a two different um, ovens. So sometimes I get customers that will come and say, uh, when they see an electric oven, they will think it's a microwave. A microwave is different from electric oven. Electric oven, you use it for drying of items, use it for roasting. But your microwave, you use it to warm your food, preheat it, or, you know, defrost the food and stuff like that, that you want to do with it. Now, we're using this Century Electric Oven to explain to you. This Century Electric Oven is a 20-liter Century Electric Oven. Now, as you're looking at it, you'll see different buttons that are lined up on it. Now, let me explain to you what those different buttons that are lined up. But before I explain it, remember, if you're buying this, mic this electric oven, make sure you go through the manual. Going through the manual will help you to understand better. What I'm teaching you is the basics. Go through the manual, it will help you to understand better. Because when you look at the manual, you see that they have about six pages of items that are teaching you. So going through the manual will help you to understand and know how to use this electric oven better. Now, let me come back to this button. Now you're seeing the first button here. The first button here, we have the 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes. We have the 60 minutes. All these things are the number of minutes, the how long you can leave whatever thing you're doing inside here. Whether you're cooking, whether you're roasting, whatever thing you're doing inside this oven. This is telling you how long you can leave it. And this is not just 10 minutes. If you look closely here, here is 1 minute, here is 5, and here is 10. Here is 15, here is 20. So you can actually select whichever one you want. It's, it's all these things you're seeing, all these dots are at the 1-1 one, one minute. So it's in 1-1 one, one minute. Now, this second one here, if you look closely inside here, you will see you will see that we have the heating agent, which is this one, this, this heating element, the first one here, and the second one here. We have heating element at the upside, we have heating element at the downside. So depending on the one you want to use, this is what controls it. This one, if I turn it here, that means I'm using the one up. You see that there's a line here. There's a small dashed line here telling you that it's for the upside. And if you look this side, you see that there's a small dashed line here telling you it's for the downside. So if I want to use the one down, I turn it to the downside. And then if I want to use both of them, I turn it down. You see that this boat here is telling you both the up and the down. Now I want to off it and I off it. Then this other one here, depending on what I want to roast or whatever I want to do inside the oven. Now, there are certain degrees you're not supposed to cross depending on the item you are you want to roast inside here or you want to use the oven for. So let me say you want to um, you want to roast your meats. Let me say they will tell you for I, I'm not a, I'm not a baker, I'm not a cooker. So for those who cook will understand better. Now if you want to let me say you want to do your meat, you want to probably roast it. If you know you're not supposed to cross 150 degree, you won't put it on 150. You won't take it above that 150 degree. The degree is telling you the amount of heat that is generating. So if I'm taking it to 100 degree, it means it's giving me a degree of 100. 100 degrees is like boiling point of water. Now, if I'm taking it to 150, it means I'm increasing the heat, the heating uh, element. I'm increasing the, the heat that is coming out from this boat element. Now, if I'm, taking it to one, if I'm taking it to 200 or 250, it means that the heat I want from it has to be higher. So you need to know the amount of heat you need from the item you want to use the electric oven for. That's the work of these um, minutes that are lined up here. Now... So depending on what you want to do, you can use any of them. This two trays is what comes with it. And when you see inside the oven, you will see this uh, handler. I call it handler. You can call it whatever you want to call it, but this I, I call it handler. Now, what's the work of this? Let me say I'm roasting, whatever I'm roasting inside here, and I want to bring it out. I'm done. I want to check it to be sure that it's, um, it's not getting burnt on just one particular side. I open it. When I open it, I use this handler. I did like this. And I bring it out. So you use it to carry, you use it to carry it. And when you want to push it, you push it inside. The same thing with this one here. If I want to bring it out, I bring it out with this. And I, if I want to put it back inside, I put it back inside. 
So that's how you use this wonderful electric century 20 liters oven. Now, let me let me practicalize it in as much as there is no item inside. Now, if I want to on it, the only place you can on this oven from is from the minutes. So if you're done selecting what you want to select, let me say I want to just use the elements that is at the downside. So I turn it down to this place. I've turned it to this element, to the place I want to use it. Then I select the amount of um, degree I want. Let me say I want just 100 degree. I want it to be at 100 degree. Then what next? Then I on it. On it to the time I want. I want it to be at 20 minutes. And I'm using it now. So you can see the light indicator is showing you that it is on. So that's how you use this Century Electric Oven, 20 liters. That's all for today. See you next Friday. Thank you.